Keith Moreland, Greg Swindell as the Islanders of Texas A&M Corpus Christi visit Austin to take on the Longhorns in the first inning. Got off to a hot start they did as LeBaron Johnson faces Trey Jones and Zeke, this is as far as you can hit one. That's a Mendez territory out there. The ball went over the monster. Uh, two out knock, home run for the Islanders. Jalen Flores had not had a hit as a Longhorn. He comes to the plate in the second, and he ties the game up with his first career hit, first career on the yard, first career home run. And, uh, got some extension, barreled it up over the wall on the left. That's a tie game. And we, we get out, and then in the third inning, it became a two-out situation with them loaded. Jake O'Dowd with a base hit to right, but here in the Longhorns get some separation, take a three-to-one lead. Right behind him, coming to the plate is Mitch Daly, and he drives a single to left. Well, just like that, the Longhorns have a four-to-one lead. Good to see those two have big nights for Texas. In the fifth inning, it's O'Dowd again. It's a sacrifice fly to center for his third RBI of the night. Well, that would lead to a sixth run. Fifth inning for Texas, led by that man right there. Gets one, just misses a grand slam off the wall and right. DK will dive head first in the third with a three RBI triple. And then getting it going is you see a ground ball right here. They called it an E5 or E6. Campbell gets in there and then the, the wild pitch coming into the plate to score is Campbell started just separating. Then in the eighth inning, Longhorns with a big lead. But Mitch Daly was at the plate, swings and misses. Coming in to score is O'Dowd. And Longhorns go on to a 12-2 victory.